everybody! Welcome back to Northern Lion Place of Binding of Isaac Afterbirth Plus. I uh, you know what? Let's mix it up. Challenges. We got we got some left to do. Pokemons and Ultra Heart. It's not that bad. It's not that bad. Pokemans we can live with. I don't even know if you can have the seed, by the way. F D P Y D R T M. That's where it is. Um I at least now know Oh god, stop. I at least now know what I'm getting myself into on the Pokemans challenge. What's the trick? Well, there I mean there isn't a trick. You want to still get Doruka, don't you dare. You want to get stacked up as good as possible. Like there's no doubt about that. Um with items, you know, you you still have to deal with the devil, deal with the angel sort of situation, and you still have boss items available as well. You just don't have uh item rooms. We can still get good stuff from shops as well. Uh we have an extra Added layer. Uh, you okay, buddy? Oh, oh, shoot me! Shoot me! No! We have an extra added layer of, of potential benefit, uh, and that extra layer is we want to stack up the best Pokemon available. Any, uh, any familiar or, you know, friend who does contact damage? No, thank you. Not interested. Uh, they will be a useful Pokemon once and once only, as they jump into enemies and then immediately die and grant us a free token for another one. Uh, but apart from that, not going to be any good long term. So for example, we will lose this bomb fly uh, very, very shortly. There he goes. That's not too bad. We should stop throwing uh, the Pokemon at... That's the ticket right there. That's the ticket. It's a ghost Pokemon. So we'll grab this. Don't really give a crap about anything else here. Hello, hey, it's a cat on my desk. Where do cats go? They go on the desk. Just kidding, they go on the box. Hang with Tomo, please. Hang with Tomo, please. Why do you think you're a higher species? You are both the little kitty cats. Why do you sleep in different spots? Okay, this is... Ridiculous. Don't explode him next to my ghost friend. Do I still have a ghost friend? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Uh, honestly, this uh, enemy I don't think is inclined to do contact damage. Doesn't... Oh, he does teleport too, so... Just not as often as the ghost. So I think we might get lucky and... Uh, never have to worry about him taking damage either. But obviously, like, that other dude is like one of the worst... Oh my god, he walked right into an enemy. Oh, don't even get me started on these freaking... The guts just go straight into the freaking corner. Either way, like, of the remaining challenges... Ooh, don't mind that. Of the uh, remaining challenges, Pokemans is the easy one, for sure. For sure. Ultra Heart is the one that's totally stupid. No deal with the devil? Did I take... Oh, you... NL. NL. Work with me here, buddy. NL. You, yourself. Okay, now there's a reason not to go. Hey, moron. What the hell? Why'd you take red heart damage going into the curse room before you fought the boss? It's like you're thinking you're in a different game here. That was a an extreme lapse in my judgment for sure. That was a complete waste of a Pokeball charge? I don't know what I was thinking there. Like maybe I could use it and then the enemy would follow me out. Maybe I'm like really happy to have uh, a guts here. Because he appears to be nearly invincible. So, you know, kudos to me, I suppose. For getting the best familiar money can buy. I'm just waiting for the day we get our free charge. When that guts gets fucking exploded. Like, can we do it ourselves? Nope. Alrighty. Come on, dude. You couldn't at least hit the button? That's all I ask. Three room will reroll everything. <gasps> the mimic got me! It's been a while since I got got by a Mimic. I can't believe that the Guts just will not die. Wait, 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 wait. We have a good ghost and a red ghost. We have a red ghost and a white ghost. This is incredible. The red ghost is actually the good ghost because the Brimstone is ridiculously powerful. The other ghost is, is a nice helper that's hard to kill, but damn, dude, that is sick. I don't know why they're shooting at me instead of at the boss, which, you know, has a hitbox, I'm guessing. Based on the fact that I am hitting it right now. But he did get dusted pretty hard though. We'll take Synth Oil, which is good. The Spearhead Heart and the Krampus Fight. Doesn't bother me too much. More ghosts, please. Oh, a single neutral fly, huh? 
That was weird. He had like a delay on his shot there. Oh! Oh! He wiped me! What the fuck, dude? I had the greatest selection! He took out two ghosts! It might take me the rest of the freaking game to get two ghosts back! Look, it's in the spirit of the challenge. To... To keep rolling with the Pokeball here. We weren't holding the Pokeball at the time of death, so that doesn't help us. Um, I can't believe that somehow... How did the Guts survive? Uh, and the answer is probably that it's just bugged. But how did the Guts survive a Krampus diagonal shot? That just makes no sense to me. Health down, huh? You wouldn't! You wouldn't! I know you! You wouldn't! I know you, game! You think I don't know you. You're just throwing me for a loop right now because you you feel like, Oh, NL, he's getting too good, too big for his britches. You, there's no conceivable way that you would be like, You know what? Let's start fucking his run over right now. Alright, there goes... Well, it's only a 1 in 400 chance. Nope. It's another grandfather fly. This one's already getting shot at, which makes no sense to me, but at least it's not trying to do contact damage. Okay, it has done some contact damage. Thank you, thank you. This guy is not long for the world. Let's be realistic. The guts will never die. I think the caveat there is that it also will never deal any damage, so... Uh, not necessarily a win. Don't kill him! Leave him alone! Keep in mind, we do have likely boss rush access if that's something we want. Well, we've really managed to get all of the worst possible uh, all of the worst possible uh, red chest drops so far, so I'm really appreciative of that. Not a good boss for us, but again, if we stand still... I thought he would create flies instead. No, no, don't blow that. Oh, God. <laughs> it's like, just don't blow up our familiars with the thing that... Oh, no! Get out of here, you jerk! I don't want to deal with you, you, you freaking nut job, man. We let a sleeper agent into our Pokemon cell here. Oh my god, there goes our eternal heart. Shot that came out of the freaking ether. Couldn't even see it. It's not this too much, dude! You spawned too much. You took a good thing. And you messed with it for no reason. You spawned too many things on this room. It's not conceivable. Okay, we're tilting, but we're tilting for a good reason, I think. Um, and that's because that room sucks and is bullshit. We have a ghost enemy that only appears on the screen half the time, so that's... Oh, it's a doppelganger. So, majority of the time, yeah. This probably will do nothing until it dies. To be honest with you, the candle is an easy win, and your boy's getting close to just wanting to take the easy way out on this challenge, the way probably absolutely everybody else did. But I guess we'll we'll make it we'll make blue candle a game time decision when we finish off with this uh when we finish off with this. Uh although, gotta be honest with you, the fact that you gave me a fucking uh, are you a wizard pill makes the decision a little easier. Oh, we have a- we have a charge. More nubs, please! Spawn more nubs! It just spawned a mask that does nothing! The mask does- it just dies immediately. Am I playing the strongest game I've ever played in my life? No. Of course not. That's a ridiculous question. It's a loaded question. Quite frankly, it's, you know, yellow journalism. Gotcha journalism to come at me with questions like that. It's ridiculous. So, instead, I'm going to refuse to answer that question. Instead, I'm going to push the blame on other people and say, How could you do this to me? You're treating me unfairly right now. I would very much like for you to provide me some items that actually give me a fair shot at winning. Or, I will take Blue Candle and I will circumvent the norms and I will win your run regardless of whether or not you want me to. Magician Tower? It didn't get the stone chest. No item room. I've been walking around like, where's the item room? There's no freaking item room. I don't think I said where's the item room, but in my head, I assure you, I was thinking to myself, where the heck's the item room? On myriad occasions. I thought this to myself, silently, as I cried into the night asking why this challenge has to fuck me when I'm trying to be nice to it. Like, this is a challenge I've had a... 
I've had a positive opinion, or tried to have a positive opinion about this challenge on the regular. Why do you treat me like this? I mean, is it all because I fucked up the first deal with the devil? We've only just begun. Come on, fat bat Tomo fly. You got you got more heart and soul than this guy's got in his fucking entire ball sack. By our powers combined, we will very slowly end your life. No, we didn't get the deal, and honestly, like that's pretty fair. That's not gonna stop me from being a little irritated, but let's take a step back. And recall, we only have to go to the chest. Or and by, and by the chest, I mean the cathedral. We only have to go to the cathedral. That's not that bad. Still, are we are we on pace for that right now? No, of course not. If you looked at this run, we're in a the hellish hellscape of unfortunate consequences and unlikely situations that could not be foreseen in advance. But I'm not gonna take blue candle. I'm going to persevere with the run as it was intended, because I have more respect for the game than the game has for me, and that is where I will differentiate myself. We will head down to the next floor. Ooh, but we'll get an eternal heart first. We'll get an eternal heart first. Ah, okay. Well, full run reroll. Full run reroll. I don't ask for them very often. Not a full run reroll. Bob's brain. Yeah, again, not a good use of that uh, Pokemon, but Bob's brain, decidedly not terrible when our damage is, like, not appropriate for the challenge at hand. I'll be honest with you, if I win this run, I'm gonna be happy I didn't take Blue Candle. If I lose this run, I'm gonna be inconsolable. Because that means I have to do the fucking challenge again because of some misguided sense of honor. Okay, yeah, just walk right into the bone. Who cares, dude? Just do it. It'll be fun. Ah, oh, yes, of course. You are enemies of the state now, because of sensibility. Oh, we got a ghost. We got an enemy who will probably teleport into other enemies, but if he doesn't, could be pretty good. Oh, we almost got it. Oh, we killed the ghost! Ruka, I'm just gonna be straight up with you, okay? If you don't want to deal with the loud, you know, occasional yelling that comes with the fucking job, Go sleep outside the way you always do. I get it. You want to be close to me. This is a necessary part of the business, though. Occasionally, I'm going to show emotion for once in my life. Honestly, I think we need Isaac's fork. I will almost never say that, but uh, I think this run might be Isaac's fork territory. Really like that my, um, my familiar's shots actually home in on me. I think that's a very, very nice touch. Why would I want them to home in on the enemy? It's nonsensical. I don't care about the HP. The HP is fucking meaningless at this point. Don't give me HP bullshit. Give me Humbling Bundle. Give me a Spirit Art. Give me a better card. Wheel of Fortune. I'm going to blow your card up because it sucks. And I'm going to purchase this. I'm going to take my Fool card back. And I'm going to head down to the next floor. And I'm going to beat the game. That's what I'm going to do. I am going to beat the game. Cat, I love you. Light of my life. Take your paw off my keyboard. Especially the key that I use to designate whether it's time to record or not. Because if you accidentally stop recording, there's going to be hell to pay. Especially because I'm about to win. Without a doubt in my mind. Not a second secret room, huh? Makes sense. Alright, watch out. Watch out, because you're going to get Bob's brain. You want to use it, but you want to use it against the, you know, fleshy parts. It's going to be a long fight. That's it, that's it. Oh, it hit, it hit. Swarm of flies. Not that bad. Oh, Bob's brain's ready. It did damage. It did damage. What happened? Our, our grandfather fly died. Probably ages ago. I'm thinking back now. Okay, get ready. Get ready to land a fleshy shot. Oh, walked right into it. At least we hit the, the, the soft part. Got a bat. The bat is dead. Uh, okay, we, we need this. Shit, this is like exactly the situation we were in earlier. On the last Pokemans run. I think it's official. 
with all respect given to the developers, the Pokemans challenge can basically suck on my testicles for incentivizing getting rid of the flavor of the challenge. I'm not saying it's easy to come up with challenges. I'm just saying I don't know if this is the one that I would have gone with first off. Beautiful. What could go wrong? Gotta, you know, pour one out. Certainly, you gotta say that Guts has been like a top 1% Pokemon. It's lived for like eight floors. Now, has it done any damage? That's ignorant. You're ignorant. Why? I don't quantify familiars based on the amount of damage they deal for me. I, it's about the goodness in their fucking heart, okay? So why do you have to bring damage into it? <gasps> it's a full run reroll. So how do you tackle a full run reroll? I think we go and see if we get a deal with the devil first. Which is seeming very likely for the first time in infinity years. Uh, and then we probably take it regardless. Knowing full well that it is... Why are their animations so messed up on the brimstone here? It's super weird. Um, knowing full well that we're, we're going to lose the flavor of the challenge. You know what? I gave the game the opportunity to collaborate. It chose to be adversarial instead. That's you. You did that. You did that. We got a bad deal with the devil item, which might mean it's an ideal item to reroll. Take this. Take this. You think I'm gonna fight the angel statue? The angel statue can actually suck on my angel statue, if you know what I mean. Eggplant emoji. So, yeah, get the fuck out of here. I don't care about you. If if we reroll into dog shit, I will never forgive myself. But we gotta we gotta do it. Yeah, no more Pokemon. We got a severe damage downgrade. <laughs> Why? Why? Um, and we're moving along here. But I'm not super, you know, pleased with the reroll. I, I don't believe it. Maybe we get what we deserve, you know? And in the end, the love you take is equal to the love you make. I don't know if we rerolled into an item that is good. Like, I'm, I'm skeptical that we have gotten like any value. Gemini and maybe the familiar um that is the the razor blade. Those are decent. Everything else is kind of horrible though. Leaving the curse room. We might have taken half from entering as well. I'm not sure. Hey, now that you've given up your space bar item, here's a room with five batteries in it. It'll be pretty fun to use your Pokémon's item on them. Oh wait, you got rid of it. If only you'd held out for one more floor, Northern. What's wrong, Northern? I thought you were keeping it flavored. I thought that's what you wanted. They say if you're good, do a challenge. But remember, they know the scum techniques too. Now and when I get you, get you, get you. I'm making a battery charge per enemy. I'm gonna give you no DPS, no HP, and no deals with the devil, and I'm rock with you. Please. Look at this room. There are six battery charges on the ground. There are eight battery charges on the ground. There's eight battery charges on the ground. No, I don't, I don't care. You can't hurt me anymore. I am immune to pain. You've insured yourself. Or you've insured that I will <laughs> never again feel the sting of disappointment or sadness or frustration. You've done this. Remember always. I thought that the ultra hard challenge was the only challenge that was unfair. How naive I was. You have made me a great proponent of Lovecraftian universal indifference. The idea that we live in a cold universe that cares not for us. It is mechanics driven rather than emotion driven. Bad things can happen to good people. You've done this. On the Pokemans challenge. Taking something that's supposed to be about the purest joy a man and a Pikachu can ever find in each other's company. And you've made it something evil and disparaging and as a result it's all I have left to defeat you how did you die so fast that doesn't make sense 
I'm not doing enough damage to kill you that quickly. I also don't have enough range to actually attack you when you do that attack, so if you could stop that forever, that'd be sick. Gemini is my best damage dealer, so I approximately have the same DPS as a normal character would have on, like, the first floor. Um, Rotten Baby, dude, shows up at the end of every single run. Absolutely, sign me up for the Rotten Baby. Hey, take a drinking game, drink a whole drink anytime you re-roll your run and get, uh... The $3 bill or fruitcake. Actually, don't do that, because you'll die if you do more than, you know, X runs a day. <laughs> what a hilarious joke. Really executed on that one well. So, what's what's the secret on this run? Well, it's very simple. Um, strike while the iron's hot. Hope that you, <laughs> hope that you get a good uh, item or a good $3 bill effect when you walk into a room. Oh, another battery charge. Thanks. Really appreciate it. I am actually, I mean, I have to keep in mind that it's just, like, a brief bit of mental focus here can guarantee me never having to do this fucking challenge again. And this isn't even the harder one, dude. This is, this one's fine. Probably. Um, but, it's so remarkable to me that after suffering through... Bad Pokemon after bad Pokemon after bad Pokemon after bad Pokemon. We got a chance to reroll our whole run. And what did we get out of it? A worse run. We were actually better off just never using the Pokeball again, or continuing to use it, and then using our tears, which were actually decent. Instead, um, our full run reroll has basically tried to put us in the ground prematurely here. I'm, I'm, in many ways, I'm stunned. In some ways, couldn't be any less surprised if I wanted to be. Can you stop jumping away from bombs? Like, I know you think that makes you cool. It doesn't make you cool. It just makes you a, a jerk. I can't even hit, I'll get a little quick running gun. These guys jump where I'm not, I'm not even going. They don't jump in my position. They jump where I'm going to go to. Oh my God, it's a boss fight. It's a ghost. Oh. Are you kidding me with that? Okay, I've tilted. And I'm, me tilting means I have to take responsibility. Save your bombs, fuck the second secret room, use them on the boss fight. Yeah, they're, they, as you can see, they do a lot of damage, so... I can't hit you. I can only hit you with Rotten Baby. This is an embarrassment to Isaac. If this was like a player's first run, they would never play again. They would leave. I mean, how would they unlock the challenge to begin with? You know, it doesn't start unlocked probably, but still, you know, ignoring that. They would leave, they would say to you, I don't wish to play that game, it takes 45 years to kill enemies. And you'd have to be like, no, wait. Don't worry about it. So, thank Christ for whatever our halved damage is. And thanks, thank Christ for uh, an orbital. Okay, that, that's too much damage. We're still in the clear, but that's too much damage. We have two bombs left. Crack them in there. Thank you. Much appreciated. Rotten baby, you're doing your part. I appreciate it. In a in a cold and unfeeling universe, you remain my light. Please, please, death's touch. Please. He has no animation on his shots. It's so hard to tell. It's looking increasingly likely that we're going to actually do this. We have less starting damage than any character in the game right now, to the best of my memory. But our rate of fire is actually pretty good. I will say our rate of fire is pretty good. Confirmed, easiest run of all time. Alright, that's the Pokemon's challenge. Charged key. Interesting. We're never gonna do that one again. Thanks for watching. I hope I wasn't too whiny. If you did enjoy, click the like button. It helps out a great deal. And of course, subscribe if you want to see more in the future. But for now, thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.